Yeah, we got interviews, fun stuff, all you could think of at LA Comic Con. Let's do this. Nerd Soul. Late Ill Kid at One Young So holding it down, bringing that street geek and nerd soul. What is up, my people, today? I got my man Chuck. What's up, man? What's up? So, you just got through your panel, mm -hmm. music and comics. Yes. Uh, you know, how it's fusing, how one's feeding off the other, how they're growing together. Mm -hmm. What was your biggest takeaway from that panel? Um, Mine is people are savvier than people think. Okay. There's a lot of people, there's a much more interested audience in seeing more of that happening. All right. Um, people used to take the music added to anything, whether it's comics or animation. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Or movies, for granted. And I think that's changed. And like I told the, the panel, this has always been there. It's just has become more aware, definitely in the last 25 years. Okay, okay. Especially so, with music growing and getting stronger and hip-hop yeah. particularly, yes. All right, all right. Now, what, if anything, are you working on inside of like the, the idea of music and comics? Well, I work primarily in animation now. So, um, music is very integral when you're doing film. Yes, yes. And, you know, even though we're not film, we're still approaching it's, it film. It's film. Yeah. It's so film, you know. So I'm in the middle, right now in the middle of creating a soundtrack. Okay, okay. show I'm working on. And that is? It's called Kulapari Season 2. Season 1 is on Netflix. <laughs> it's on uh, Netflix. It's yeah, actually yeah. on Netflix. Um, uh, it's pretty original. dope. Uh, that, you, was a, that was a joint. Sanford Green did some work on yes, that on yeah. the on the very first yes. uh, very first teaser or yeah, whatever, yeah, yeah, right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Actually, he did the the, um, the the character designs uh -huh. that was leading to the, the, the. It's a long story, but I'm gonna try to keep it short. Uh, <laughs> Sanford did the um, the character designs for the author for his book, and which became um, spun that off into an animated short, which yeah, he yeah. used that to pitch to the studios. Okay. Which led to me coming in and doing it as a and show. And doing your thing. And then he's trying to also do it as a comic. He just released a comic uh, earlier this year that's continuing the characters. Okay. And we're starting season two. All right, now, speaking of season two, yeah. is there anything that people should keep their eye out for in season two? Absolutely. Absolutely. <laughs> I, was telling the, I was telling the crowd how when I work with a sound with a, with a composer, uh -huh. it's, it's similar to working with a writer. We just some go down, we don't sit down and just say, hey man, give me some dope rhymes, give me some shit. No, <laughs> we're talking, I mean, he had to know what's this theme for this season. The first okay. season was discovery. Yeah. The characters learning who they are. Kind of figuring out what's going on. Becoming something else. Is he a fighter? Is he a yeah, warrior? Yeah, yeah, is he yeah, not? Yeah. This year is identity. Okay. Because we have multiple storylines and right. we have people who you think are evil, who are going to become good, and people Ooh. who we thought were good. Maybe a little shade on them, so. Just a little, just a little speck. Little just speck, little, 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 little bit of shade. Yep, yep, yep. yep. And, then, and then there's some who's just going to go full out bad. And then some wow. bad ones who does a very compassionate thing. And you're like, whoa, I didn't expect that from his butt. Yeah, so, okay, okay. That's what we've been Pretty up cool, to. pretty cool. And that's yeah. the first thing my composer asked me is like, I need to know that because when I work in the themes. Kind of like the giving that feel, that vibe yeah, through and letting it shine exactly. through. Oh, He's okay, cool. now that musical language in that I yeah. would need on those scenes where the characters aren't speaking. All right. But and I want to be able to tell something to my audience this happening. Yeah, and that kind of like, that kind of pushes it into where when you have the comics and the music, you're kind of sort of, I guess, reaching towards animation in a way where you're starting to provide more of a, a surrounded atmosphere yeah. of experiencing yeah. this. See, th you're, you're saying exactly what I can't wait from the audience, <laughs> is that people are picking up on this. And when it works, it's because the creators know that and they give you what you're looking for. Yeah. And you pick up on that. That's yeah. exactly it. That's and exactly even when it. I read comics, I'll listen to like movie scores yeah. or I'll listen to yeah. music. Yeah. It just helps a lot. It helps yeah. kind of like immerse you in that. You would never be Ooh. able to, I, I, I would defy Ooh. this. I mean, I've done enough comic books where I can tell you every soundtrack I use <laughs> to draw a scene. Wow. From, from sublime and calm and love scenes to kicking ass angry. <laughs> those are easy. Actually, those, those are Those are always those the are easy. easy ones. The okay, okay. The ones when you're in the guy's heads. And that's right. why when my composer and I are talking about identity, where characters aren't even doing a whole lot, we're setting up storylines down the way. Mm -hmm. 
So when okay, I tell him, okay. all right, this dude sounds really dope. He's really cool. But you know, in the back run, he's going to go little finger on you. <laughs> you <know? laughs> he has to know that because he's got to know that twist of the song. Yeah, and how to give that, right. provide that little right. musical right. influence right. for him. Is that. Right. Cool, cool. Well, before we bounce, where can the lovely people online find you? Oh, they will find me on Facebook. Okay. Uh, I'm, I also have an Instagram, but I, I use I use social media a lot. Okay, um, okay. Between my artists and with my fans. Um, right. So you can find me on this, Chuck Patton or PattonArt.com. Uh, not cool. .com. Um, Patton Art on Facebook. <laughs> cool, cool. My, my, you find me there. <laughs> <laughs> Word. Well, hey, it's LA Comic Con 2017. We're having a ball from us to you. Peace.